In this video, I'm going to show you which are the best web hosting providers for WordPress. I've personally tested out almost 20 different hosting providers to provide you with all the different performance results so that you can make a better informed decision on which are the best web hosting providers for you. I'm not going to waste your time here by listing all the bad hosting providers and then confusing you with all the technical jargons that most people don't understand. But instead, I'm going to provide you value by showing you the facts that actually matter. For example, the page load speed and the website uptime statistics. I wanted to be transparent with you here and let you know that I spent my own money buying all these web hosting accounts so that I can fully test them out and provide you with high quality and unbiased reviews and results. To make this test fair, I made sure to install the same starter website, theme and plugins on all my hosting accounts. Now the categories that I'll base my comparison on are price, setup and ease of use, speed and uptime performance, support and who I would actually recommend this hosting provider to. I will have a special bonus offer for you if you decide to pick up any of these web hosting plans through my special discounted link in the description below. I also have a free checklist on starting a successful blog for everyone so make sure to stick with me to the end and I'll show you how to get access to this bonus. I also just wanted to mention that these affiliate links will have exclusive discount which is lower than the normal price that you currently see on their website. So make sure to check them out if you want to get the best price on your chosen hosting provider. Now let's get straight into this video. The first hosting provider on my list is Hostinger. This is my recommended hosting provider if you're a small business with a tight budget but still want great WordPress hosting. Hostinger has the cheapest price out of any hosting providers on the market, starting at just 99 cents per month. Their next two higher plans are also really cheap for the features you get, like the increase in the number of websites you can host to 100 websites, a free domain name and free unlimited email accounts. And lastly, a notable feature which hosting it provides on their highest plan is the free automated daily backups. Many companies don't provide this feature for free, especially the cheaper ones. They try to upsell you on this, but hosting is not doing that, so well done to them. Next is the speed and uptime performance. I bought my own hosting plan from Hostinger to test out their performance. And for my speed test with GT Metrics, my site loaded in 3 seconds flat, which is actually okay and they still pass Google's recommended site speed and for the price you pay, I think it's really good. Next, I tested out hosting as uptime with Uptime Robot and they produced a 100% uptime over the 30 day period. In fact, they had no downtime for over 50 days in a row, which is an amazing streak and makes them a very reliable hosting provider. Now with the setup and ease of use, Hostinger has its own custom user interface for configuring your WordPress site called HPanel instead of the standard cPanel you normally see from many hosting providers. I find it designed to be cleaner and easier to navigate than the standard cPanel and it was also fairly easy to install WordPress and SSL certificate. As you can see here, installing your WordPress website with the HPanel is very simple. With just a few clicks and just a couple of minutes, your website is up and running. Just one negative to point out here is that some of the menu items can take a while to show up after clicking it. Another thing worth mentioning here is that hosting has seven data centers globally to host your website. This is great if your business is located outside of the United States as you can still provide your customers with great website speed. Just make sure to choose your server location which is the closest to the majority of your visitors. Hosting it provides customer support through email and live chat, but just beware that live chat is not 24 seven for new customers looking to ask questions. So you may have to email them instead here. To be honest, I was a bit disappointed about this, but understand that they need to cut costs somewhere to be able to provide their customers with such cheap plans. But at least their support is 24 seven for existing customers, which is the most important thing. I tested hosting as support team by asking them three different questions and overall, they performed okay. They helped me fully install my SSL certificate and Cloudflare CDN. They were also willing to go the extra mile and help me restore my malware infected website. The only thing they did not do was remove the malware, which was also expected. Now from contacting them at three different times of the day, I timed their average customer support response time to be 14 minutes, which was too slow for me and did not pass my five minute minimum requirement. So overall, they have good support but you will have to wait a little longer than normal. 
Now, you can see the score breakdown I gave Hostinger for each of the criteria I test them on here, and after averaging out all the scores and giving double points for the performance section, which I believe is the most important feature, Hostinger scored an 8 out of 10. They are a really solid hosting company at a really cheap price. So if you're just getting started on WordPress and you have a limited budget, then I think you can't go wrong choosing Hostinger for your WordPress website. A2 Hosting is the next company on my list. I believe they have the most features and the best support for a shared hosting provider. So if you want all the bells and whistles and expect support to be top notch, then A2 Hosting would be my pick for your WordPress website. A2 Hosting has great prices starting at $2.99 per month. Their startup and drive plans are really cheap for the features you get, like the free personal website migration and the automatic daily backups on the drive plan. However, if you want better performance, you need to go with their Turbo Boost or Turbo Max plans as you will get the added feature of the NVMe storage, their Lightspeed server which allows you to install their A2 optimized custom caching plugin to really increase your website page load speed. Even though this is more expensive, I think it is worth the extra money as I show you my performance test results of applying these features now. From the Turbo Max plan that I bought, I ran a speed test on GT Metrics and my site loaded in 2.3 seconds, which is really solid already, but then I installed the A2 optimized custom caching plugin, which is what you get on their Turbo plans. Now from the new test, my website has loaded in just 1.8 seconds. This is super fast and makes them one of the fastest shared hosting provider I have tested. They also easily pass Google's 3 second recommended site load speed. Next, I tested out A2 Hosting's uptime with Uptime Robot and they produced a 99.988% uptime over the 30 day period, which is not the best overall, but still very reliable and passed my minimum requirement of 99.95%. Now with the setup and ease of use, once you click on the cPanel button from A2 Hosting's dashboard, it'll just take you to the standard user interface where you can do things like installing your WordPress website and SSL certificate. You'll also be able to create your email address and do any other adjustments to your WordPress site from here. As you can see here, installing the WordPress site with cPanel is not complicated at all. It is really simple, but the process just doesn't look beautiful, which for me, I'm okay with. Another thing worth mentioning is that A2 Hosting has four data centers in three different countries which you can host your WordPress site on. This is really handy for all non-US businesses. A2 Hosting provides 24-7 customer support through email, live chat and phone call so you can get in contact with them at any time of the day. I tested out A2 Hosting by asking them the same three questions and they overall did a really good job. They helped me fully install my SSL certificate and Cloudflare CDN. They were also willing to go the extra mile and scan my website and produce a malware report for me even though this was not within the scope. The only thing they did not do was remove the malware and I was asked to pay extra for this service which I expected anyway. Now from contacting them at three different times of the day, I timed their average customer support response time to be three and a half minutes which was not the fastest but passed my minimum requirement of five minutes. Now after averaging out all the points for each section, A2 Hosting had an overall average score of 8.5 out of 10. They are a really solid hosting provider with tons of unique features like their A2 optimized caching plugin and the free website migration. And not to mention, their support was also top notch. So if you care about these things the most, then I recommend you give A2 Hosting a try. I have also made detailed individual reviews on all the hosting companies on my list today. So if you want more information on a particular hosting provider, then you can check it out by clicking on one of the links in the description below. Here's a quick question for you. What is the main criteria you use to pick your hosting provider? Is it speed, support, or performance? Let me know in the comments section below. The next hosting provider on my list is GreenGeeks. I'm giving them the gold medal for being the best performer in terms of speed and uptime. If you want the fastest speed from a shared hosting provider while still performing well in other areas, then GreenGeeks is the best choice for your WordPress site. GreenGeeks has great prices on all three of their hosting plans. The Lite plan starts at just $2.49, which is really cheap. 
and their next two plan, which provides you unlimited websites and an increase in speed, is also very affordable. All their plans also come with free automatic nightly backup and they use light speed servers like A2 Hosting, which are meant to be super fast. A bonus from Green Geeks is you will get a free domain name for your first year on any of their hosting plans. Now in terms of the website speed, I installed the Lightspeed caching plugin, which will only work with hosting companies that uses Lightspeed servers and is meant to be more on the high end. My GT metrics results shows that my site loaded in just 1.4 seconds, which makes them the fastest shared hosting provider on this list. Next is the uptime robot results. And this one was also a perfect 100% uptime. And they kept this awesome streak going for 95 days in a row. Green Geeks uses a simple cPanel user interface with a few added custom things like the SSL certificate. As you can see here, installing the SSL certificate can be done on their custom dashboard if you find that easier than using cPanel, which is still possible with Green Geeks. Next is the installation of your WordPress website. This one is done on cPanel the normal way. Simple, clean, but not that pretty. Green Geeks has three data centers in the United States, Canada, and Europe which is not as many as some other hosting providers, but still good enough for diversification and is still useful for non-US businesses. Green Geeks provides 24 seven customer support through email, live chat, and phone call. From the same three questions I asked Green Geeks, they answered them all really well. They were really knowledgeable and helpful. Their only letdown was that their live chat support wait time average was only 16 minutes, which is over my five minute limit. Now after adding up all the points, Green Geeks produced an overall score of 8.5 out of 10. You can see here, I'm only showing you the best performers from the almost 20 hosting providers I've tested. Do you like the level of detail I'm providing you in my roundup review so far? If yes, make sure to let me know by liking my video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on more high quality videos that I'll be releasing every week. The next hosting provider on my list is Kinsta. This is my choice for the best premium option and would also be the best overall for your WordPress site if you have the money. They are not your typical shared hosting provider, but instead they are more of a managed WordPress cloud hosting solution. So if you're not so concerned with price and just want the best of the best, then I believe Kinsta is the one for you as they were one of the top overall web hosts from the list of almost 20 different companies I tested. Kinsta's cheapest plan start at $30 per month on the starter plan which is for one website and 25,000 monthly visitors. I think this is quite expensive, but it's justified by using Google Cloud Platform to increase their performance, and they also have the most professional customer support team. Kinsta is a top of the line host. They use their own CDN and have server-side caching, which means it is faster than using your normal WordPress caching plugins. They will also personally migrate your website to them for free. They have the free automatic daily backups, and also have free malware removal included on all their plans. You can see here, they pretty much have every feature available to you already included in the price. Now for the website speed, my GT metrics results show that my website with Kinsta loaded in just 1.1 seconds, which makes them the fastest host on my list. You can see a trend here, right? Next is the uptime robot result. And this one was also a perfect 100% uptime with 45 days straight of no downtime. Kinsta has their own custom user interface, which I found to be one of the easiest and most comprehensive to use. Everything is laid out nicely and they don't confuse you with all the buttons and settings like some other competitors. Installing your WordPress site is also very simple as I show you a real life demo of it right here. Just a few clicks and you're up and running. The SSL certificate is also the same. A really easy few clicks will get that done for you as well. Kinsta has 24 server locations worldwide, which is the most out of any companies on this list. So no matter where you are in the world, I know Kinsta will have you covered. Kinsta provides 24 seven customer support through live chat and email. From the same questions I asked them, they answered them all the best and fixed and installed everything I wanted. They were one of the only companies willing to remove malware from me free of charge. They really go above and beyond for their customers here. Really well done. Now their average customer support wait time was also only one minute and 30 seconds, which is incredible. So really great customer support overall here from Kinsta. Now after adding up all the points, Kinsta scored an almost perfect 9.5 out of 10. 
they only lost half a point due to their price. But I can't complain as everything else was pretty much perfect here. So overall, if you're not concerned about price, then Kinsta really can't be beaten and will be the best choice for your business in my honest opinion. This is a quick note regarding my bonus offer to you. If you decide to pick up any of these web hosting plans through my link, then just send me your receipt to bonus at .com and I'll send you back access to my bonus course right away. It's that simple. And if you want my free checklist on starting a successful blog, then just go to this link in the description to get access to that. Now I think picking the right hosting provider for your business is such a crucial step and you must get this right. So now that you have picked a great hosting provider from this list, you are now ready to go out and fully build your own successful website. And this next video will help you do just that. So check it out and I'll see you over there.